Hey guys, and welcome back to Turok. When we last left off, we made it into this command center type doodad, and it looks like our friend Kane is up to no good. What well, we've got? Exponential increase in evolutionary activity. Hmm. Well, that doesn't sound good. Is he evolving the dinosaurs? If he, is he evolving the soldiers? We don't know. I can't remember. Oof. But I guess we've got to find out. Who's that? We have a bold man. And <laughs> helicopter sound just like cuts out halfway through. Yeah, cool. You know you're playing an old game. Uh, ooh, weapons. Nah, we don't want pistols. I don't see the point in them. Alright, well, onwards and upwards, so they say. Oof, I hear soldiers. Soldiers full of holes. Oh god, I forgot the, the aiming. The aiming's... I don't know. It's not bad. Uh, but the analog sticks definitely do feel not quite as uh, responsive, should we say, as uh, modern games. Yeah, it's something to do with like the dead zones at these. Oh god, hello. Oh, fuck me. He's throwing grenades at me. Cheers, pal. Yeah, uh, definitely not as responsive as uh, modern consoles. Not that I ever really enjoy playing FPS games on a control pad anyway. But um, it's definitely improved over the years. Right, what have we got here? What's that? It's ammo for the sticky gun, I think. Why does it sound like we're wearing half a pound, half a ton of leather? We've got really squeaky boots. <laughs> I've just noticed that, and it's going to really irritate me. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go. Come on, boys. Let me introduce you to my little friends. There we go. Get fucked. Who's next? There's some little turd up there somewhere. All right. Well, show yourself, fool. Oh, God. Oh, he's way up in the distance. Alright, in that case. Now, I'm pretty sure, although you get slightly less damage when you put the silencer on, it gives you a much tighter group on the old uh, accuracy. Yeah, definitely. Oh, my God. Because the damage reduction doesn't really feel that um, noticeable, to be honest. So, might as well just go with, uh, go with the silencer on. Or well, the suppressor, I believe, is the accurate term. And someone else is shooting at me, but God knows where. We've got enemies below us. Oh, God, look at that. There's some straight-up Star Wars shit going on down there. Okay. Oh, there's a lot of computers. And stuff. A lot of, uh, Oh, God. Hey, fellas. So, there's a lot of equipment here. Looks very, uh, Quake. In fact, actually, there's a, this is a very Quake-feeling game. And, um, when I was thinking about playing this, I nearly did Quake 4 instead. Nearly. Uh, I just really fancy playing a shooter. Right, okay. You right there. Hiding behind that box. You can't shoot me through a box, dude. At least, I'm hoping you can't shoot me through a box. He's just... <laughs> he's Look, Mom, dancing! Uh, that's not what I wanted to push. I wanted to push that. Let's see if we can just fuck a grenade over to him. Whoa! Holy shit. Yeah, we can, uh, we can really throw those things. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we could really throw those grenades. Actually, let's go back and get some more. So, ooh, there's a ladder as well. I wonder where the ladder leads. Oh, there's a ladder going down. Okay, we've got some verticality here. Cool. Yeah, very uh, interested in seeing some more Turok in the future, but I don't know, man. I, I, I'm not sure. Um, I know Acclaim actually bought out the comics, because Turok was a comic originally. 
Is there no nades in here? Yeah, there is. Um, and Acclaim actually apparently bought out Turok originally so they could uh, have their own character so to speak. And they wanted a character that they could license out for products, games, comics, the whole the whole works basically. But unfortunately it didn't go very well. Which is a shame because actually Turok in the Lost World and all that kind of stuff, there's some potential there. I mean this ain't really it Chief. This is a far cry from you know the original Turok but uh, who knows man. They could have worked some uh, more of the time traveling voodoo in, I guess. Ah, this is more like it. We've got dudes. That's fine. And I've said it before, right? These enemies are so generic, but they're really satisfying to take out. They really are. Oh, God. With Yeah, we're hosed. Oof. Got some crossfire there. Couldn't quite make it to the cover if you're hurt grab some cover whilst you heal yeah Ooh. okay this game's gonna be fairly savage I think with its checkpoints but that's okay that's okay oof man that's never gonna get old I don't think All right let's grab up some gear not sure what I think about nades I mean they seem fairly Useful, I guess, but kind of unpredictable. Um, I don't remember much about the multiplayer. I think I played it a little bit back in the day. It was fairly standard stuff. Um, inoffensive, I think, is fair to say. It had some interesting modes, but none of it was really that fleshed out. And we do not want to be standing next to this explosive barrel. Not really. There we go. I see you up there, you little fucker. Picked up SMG ammo. Cool. Alright, move, move, Turok. Move your ass. See if we can just snipe this bastard. There he is. Ooh, right in the guts. Good night, sweetheart. Alright, let's put the uh, silencers on both of these guns. So I think it does make a, a noticeable difference in your accuracy. Who shoot me now? Where are you, you little cock? Is he swearing at me? Dude. That's what I think of you, pal. <clears throat> yeah, definitely a tighter group on that. I like it. Okay, cool. Now, I'm looking forward to rediscovering all of the weapons in this game. Because I really can't remember them. I'm guessing we get some kind of assault rifle, and I think there's a shotgun. But as I said before, I think the main weapons pretty much throughout this game are these SMGs. Uh, we're going to be leaning on them fairly heavily anyway. Look at this motherfucker up here. Literally has no idea what's going on. Ah, you lucky fucker. You're gone. I'm on him. Dude, oh, we pinned him. I can't remember what the achievement was. I think we have to pin X amount of enemies. Uh, right, to rock. So it was kill. All th oh, right, we've got to do the copperhead pin th 50 enemies with the bow in campaign mode. Eh, I mean, I'm guessing that probably won't be super hard but I'm not really sure not really sure how good the pinning mechanics are to be honest I'm not gonna rely on them too much because I think the enemies have to be pretty close to whatever you're trying to pin them to Oh god, that's so satisfying. You know, obviously there's nothing to pin him to. <laughs> I thought he was actually an enemy there. And it's taken me some time to get used to the fact that uh, Y is the crouch button. That's really weird. But hey, you know. 
We'll get used to it after a while. Janky ass controls. Yeah, there was another ladder up there. Maybe that's the way we're supposed to go. We'll check that out. There might be some good goodies there. Oh, hey guys. Welcome to the party, pal. Oh, yeah. That's how it's done. Ooh. Let's get rid of those. I was going to say, you never know what's hidden behind these things. Always worth scoot. Yeah, so pinning 50 enemies with a bow, that's a lot of enemies. Oh, hey friend, where the fuck did you come from? Oh shit. They're below us too. Damn. Oh god. Hey guys. Not sure if these guys randomly spawn in. Or maybe we just passed a trigger point. That was weird. Alright. Have to pay attention to that. I do like the kind of like high tech quiver that we've got going on there. It's pretty cool. There doesn't look like there's much up here. Maybe an armory? Yeah, there's some extra extra equipment. Arrows, nice. Oh, that just also leads there. Yeah, I can hear dudes. Ah, look. Look at that little snaky son of a fucking bitch there. See, I was hoping that would pin him to the floor. Oh, you dick. Yeah, these guys are going to be pretty hard to pin to the terrain, I think, actually. Unless we can get him to stand still for five seconds. Can I pin you to that? No. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about this whole pinning system, to be honest. Doesn't seem it doesn't seem to be that great, actually. You would have thought that uh, you could pin them to the floor and stuff like that, but maybe not. Maybe they actually have to be in cover, standing behind something, which is pretty weak, if you ask me, but hey. So I'm guessing there's different trigger points all around the map where enemies will just spawn in, unless they're just relentless in their spawning in. I'm not sure. I don't think enemies are unlimited, but I don't know. I guess we will find out. Looks like there's some guns around here. Nope. Thought there were guns. Oh. Did I just see an enemy out of my vision there? No, I think I'm going mad. Alright, fair play. we got some nades here. Cool. Although, unfortunately, as I've said, you can't use nades whilst you're dual wielding, which, yeah, okay, I get it, it makes sense, but, man. I would have liked to have. I definitely would have liked to have been able to get some use out of them. Yeah, and now the whole base knows where you are, too. Aw, so Slade's waiting for us. Bless him. Alright. Well, he's definitely uh, shaking things up just a little bit. Pissing everybody else off. So, we can go up there. Right, let's check this out. Not really sure on the value of the pistol still. Oh, more arrows. Nice. Okay. Oh. I do love it in games where um, you can set an alarm off like we have. I mean, we've really caused some shit over there. Oh, God, there's a grenade right in front of us. And you go three rooms, you know, down the hall. And everybody forgets. 
you know, what's going on? Everyone's kind of like at ease again. Yep. Find him! Come on then. Where you at? Oh, there you are. Oh, you... Oh, right in the ass. Right in the ass cheeks. That's one way of making someone's fucking ass cheeks clap. Although I think we pinned them together. Nice. Cool. Alright. I think we've cleared this out. At least thin the numbers enough. Alright, let's squeak our asses over. Yeah, it looks good. Looks good. Yeah, like the uh, I do like the bow actually. Ooh. See, he's not. Yeah, he's not pinned. He would have. Hmm. Not a fan of that mechanic at all. It just doesn't seem that useful. Unless maybe smaller enemies. It's easier to pin them, perhaps. Like the smaller dinos, I guess. Yeah, we'll play around with the mechanic a little bit later. Alright, I think we saw Slade around here somewhere. Ooh, nice. There is some good range on these things as well. Alright, fella. Where'd you go? I stopped to take a nap. <laughs> yeah, that that sounds that sounds safe. Slade. Uh, let me look around first. No, nope. looks like there's nothing here. Well, there's lots of ammo on this thing, so. Yeah, that probably worked. Oh, shit. I guess we're going up. Makes sense. Hopefully, we've got plenty of cover. I have to make use of this cover. Oof. Oh, hey, friend. Kind of hard to tell where these guys are, to be honest. Ah, there's one. Oof. Shredded him. <laughs> oh, it feels so good. So how far are we going? Oh, shit. Motherfuckers. Motherfuckers. You little bastards. That's cheating. Oh, we got a tank there. Is there vehicles in this game? I actually am not sure. But what I am sure about is I'm getting stuck on the scenery. Which does not please me. It really does not please me at all. So it's got to be said. Slade does appear to be a pretty good AI partner, actually. It's not as useless as many AI partners are these days, that's for sure. Oof, folded his ass in half. Our ammo's getting slightly questionable, but there's plenty of it here, I suppose. Cool. I don't know, Slade. You broke it. Uh oh. That's not good. At least I assume that's not good. Yeah, sure. No worries. On it, buddy. Not really sure how I'm going to achieve that, but... Ooh. Did he just... Cyberpunk his way through the floor? I think so. Alright, come on, you little fucker. Are you gonna be able to hold this place, Slade? Oh, I'm talking about. It. Of course you are. You're a bit of a badass. Alright, so it looks like we're going up. Fine. Shoot our way through these guys. Because that's just Turok's way. Proper 80s like action hero is our, our pal Turok. In fact, he would have fit in quite nicely in that scene. Now, I believe Turok is actually quite old. 
Um, I think he actually appeared in comics in the 50s, so. Bit of a missed opportunity. Action hero involving dinosaurs and time travel? Yeah, why not? Never actually read the comics, though. I'm going to guess they were pretty good because they definitely seem to have sold well. For a little niche brand, anyway. Ooh, oh no. I thought that was a new weapon for a minute. Oh, I like it. I like it when that's the objective. Don't fuck around with keys or anything. Just shoot everything. Yeah, we're on it. We're on it. Hostiles confirmed, eh? That's the last thing you're ever going to save out. I always wondered how these characters reload um, weapons as well. What's their dual wielding? I guess it's magic. Alright, let's go, Slade. I shot the big red button. Always shoot the big red button. Ready for round two. Oh, they're shooting at us from somewhere. Ah. Hey, boys. Oh, God. Hide. Let that regeneration... <laughs> do it stuff. Fuck. Yeah, this is probably going to be a little bit harder than I thought. There's nowhere really to move. They really have got... Oh, no. Where'd you go? I stopped it. Really got to do that from the beginning? Seriously? Alright, I would have thought that the uh, big red button halfway through would have been a checkpoint, but... Oof. I guess this game doesn't like checkpoints. Yeah, just shoot it, Slade. Get us moving. Or kick it, you know. I guess that's even more of a badass manoeuvre. Always work for Duke Nukem, you know. With his size 13s. Right, okay. Shoot the barrels, Slade. Definitely helps out. Ah, you motherfucker. Oh, God. Can't even see where we're getting shot at from. Yeah, that red jam does take some time to fade away. But it's all right. Oh, God. What about that? I'm not even sure it's worth shooting them. Aim for his what? Aim for his chest, I think he said. Either that or aim for his chair. Didn't realise I was sitting on a chair, personally, but hey. Oh my god, that, that health regen. It does take a little while. Get fucked. Just keep moving, just keep doing laps. Oh shit, who's shooting me in the arse? You. Little fucker. I'm stuck on something. I don't know what I'm stuck on. <laughs> I'm stuck on something. Ah, oh, shit. Have some health back, please. Please. I like that. Oh, crap. Man down. Yeah, you've got a lot of men down. Just saying. Uh, I guess it can't go past the Slade, and i got bad news for you, pal. I'm almost out of ammo. But thanks to the missus, I have a massive, great big tankard of coffee, so... Anything's possible when you're tanked up with coffee. Get fucked, pal. Get out of here. Give me some bullets. You stingy bastards. No bullets. Just have to grab them from here. I don't know if there's a limit to the ammo there that you can grab. Guess probably. 
Alright. Just that little shit left by himself. There we go. Get fucked, friend. Destroyed the blast door override. Yeah, I really would have thought this would be some kind of checkpoint. It is very odd to me that it isn't. But I guess we're just so used to, um, you know, checkpoints out the ass these days. Takes four bullets, Slade. Don't need to shoot the hell out of it. Yeah, so the only trouble with obviously having two of these things is, man, do you drain that ammo pretty quickly. Fuck. And you get stuck. Really noticing that. Oof, that didn't go overly well. Let's go with one for now. <clears throat> Half the ammo, but if we can get some accurate shots, I think that's going to count. Right, bullets. Move this thing, buddy. Here we go. Let's have some coffee whilst we're waiting. Oh, man. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Hey, friend. Yeah, I mean, single assault rifle or single SMG does seem still pretty effective. Don't really feel like you're missing out too much by only having one out. Flank him? What do you mean flank him, Slade? Can't really flank him, can we? That's just crazy talk. There we go. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay. Definitely, okay, a slight drop in firepower, but nothing too crazy. Yeah, let's not get too confident yet, Slade. Ooh. Yeah, right. Come on. You still got a long road ahead. Yeah, you can say that again. I hope you don't die, Slade. I'm starting to enjoy your company. Um, should we go for a pistol? I mean, maybe. Maybe. Ah, uh, I don't know. I guess we could go for a pistol. We'll give it a good test. Let's go. You definitely don't really get a lot of ammo for it. I think we're gonna have plenty of opportunity to I pick up more of these. I will leave you. I don't think you will, buddy. Death Valley. Oof. Looks like the bridge is out. It's like a dino farm down there. But I think we can make it up on the other side. Let's mm. do it then. Yeah. Like a dino farm, alright. Let's take the pistol out for now. So we kind of can aim down the sights with this thing. Alright. I was hoping it was going to be some kind of long-range weapon, but or at least longer range than the SMG, but I don't think it is. Hmm. Well, I don't think this game's going to get much more colourful than this. Ah. So, anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, till next time.